Welcome back to Pokemon Shield! I'm bored. What's on TV? Oh, stand by me? Back to the game. Also, they got TVs in here, and I don't know what's on them. Some scrolling something or other. Like, I have to imagine it's like a sports bar kind of thing where it's like... Yeah. Just... You, you, you don't see it for the sake of... That would be a lot of work to model, but, like, I'm assuming there's Pokemon matches in between, like, whatever these, I'm assuming, ranking things are. Yeah, gotta be something going on like that. Also, I just noticed that these socks I got have little ribbons on the side of them, and they're very cute. Gasp. Okay, so last time we spent an unnecessarily long time running around in whatever town it is that we're in. Hammerlock? Yes, Hammerlock. Hammerlock. And the door opened up to Route 6, our goal being Snow on Side, where the next gym is. So that's where we're going! Man, I should have saved on the left side of town. I got a bike. There! That's the place. <laughs> So there's not a lot for me to catch for some time, but just, uh, I don't know, still take a look at what's going on. Beat up some trainers. Take their lunch money. Get off my bike so I have a better chance of seeing any sparklies on the bridge, because we've been seeing a lot of sparklies on the bridge. Nah, you just run into Team Yale. Dang it. <laughs> there's a cobra sleeping! Let it sleep! I mean, okay. I mean, that's nice and all. Wait, let me get my big horn out and yell it at you. Let the silicobra sleep! <laughs> and I like that they're like, oh, of course, it'd be our pleasure. Go ahead, there you go. Why does he have a bobby pin on his back? Now back to you, jerk! But I, what, what's this band? Can we move, like, like how he's 10 feet to the left no, or something? No, 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 I like how he's saying, like, all this stomping around's gonna wake it up, and yet the guy's the one stomping. <laughs> Look, like I said, they got all of three brain cells in them. Three? You'd be lucky to get a one out of them. I mean, no, I don't. So if we're gonna fight, can we, like, move? There's, like, a good bridge, like, right back here. We could just have a fight. Oh, okay. Just right next to the... Nope, guess we're doing it right here. Yeah, right next to the sleeping silicobra. That's Look fine. how good that Gengar is. I forgot that's why you bought that shirt. That Gengar is so good. It's kind of surprising you didn't put Gengar on your team, but I'm assuming you don't want Barry just like micromanage everything of it. I don't know. Geng Gengar is good, but again, it just came down to what are my op like what are my options? And also, I wanted to try to not use Pokemon that like everybody already knows about, but also Gengar is very good. What? Nobody's ever heard about Gengar. They're not that popular. Okay, so Stunky. It's what is Stunky? Dark. Poison Dark. I would because I feel like a I don't have anything good against it anyway, so I might as well just stay on Gumi. Uh, ground would work, but don't have ground. Work. Uh, fighting works. It's dark. Type. Um, and Dragon Breath. Yeah, the only thing they're weak to is ground. No, no, they're weak to fighting because they're dark type. Unless Poison resists dark. I want to say poison resist it because it's not coming up on my thing. Well, then, so I'm willing to bet they even out. Well, then you're wrong. Okay, I'm just gonna dragon breath it. Yeah, They're fine. not strong against dragon. <laughs> Ribbon once again proving her disappointment in us. Nothing. I'm not bitter about that fire gym and how everyone was right. I am, I mean I am a little sad. But look, Ribbon just needs to evolve. 
Yeah. But being a friggin' dragon type, it's not gonna evolve until level, I think, 40. Yeah, 11 more levels. <laughs> so, you know. I'm glad you're using that weak thing instead of whatever you hit me with that first. Oh, they are just weak to cram. Is it poison really resist? Yeah! I guess that makes sense. You don't exactly want to punch something that's poisonous. Good job, Ribbon. You've restored my faith in you. I'm just kidding. I think um, that faith. Linoon. Uh, fighting, definitely. It's normal dark, so... Like, fight Like, normal <laughs> normal dark? Yeah. Fighting is quad effective. It sure is. Okay, um, I think... Oh, I gave everybody different items. I gave them actual items. I don't know how good most of these are. Most of... I didn't have a lot of options to choose from, so I just kind of went with, like... Eh... Remedy's also good. I guess. Good. Remedy's also good. Because Bug is super effective against Dark. Yeah, but fighting is like... Yeah, it's quad effective. Unreasonably effective. Bug has Stab, which is one and a half times, but Quad is effectively an additional two. And Remedy's also slow, so let's just go with Frame. I'm just saying. Hey, re Remedy is pretty slow. We'll pretty consistently go second. I'm just saying, that's all. I want some good, interesting new bug Pokemon come this expansion in June. Super effective! Yeah, kick him in the face. My face! Twice. I don't know why these Team Yelgrunts, the dudes anyway, look like they're like 40 years old. Like, when it zooms in on their face, I don't... Do you not know how old hey. Punk is? Like, the Punk mo uh, music genre is like 50s, 60s. Which, ironically enough, may have started in England. Hmm. Eh. Eh. Oh, eh. I, I gotta go again. I say winking. <laughs> As if anybody can see. As if you could see me. We're still quarantined. Life hard. We're still quarantined from each other. I've, I've missed touching your face. Okay, what's life hard? Dark. Just pure dark. Pure dark? Okay. I was assuming dark was in there somewhere. So... If you haven't get... I'm gonna go ahead and swap right back to... Well, no. Actually, I'm gonna swap to Remedy. Because it's not... Double weak. If you haven't gathered by now, the um, the evil teams tend to favor poison and dark types and the sighting specifically else for them. Like I figured as much. Like, like I was looking at that going, it's a cat. What is it? Normal something? Nah, gotta have dark in there somewhere. Like Team Magma was specifically all fire and ground types and Team Aqua's water types. Which with that combination, you think Team Aqua would win always, but... I don't think I'm going to one-shot it, so let's try out this fancy new Fury Cutter. Yeah! Dodge it! This is the nice thing about having high affection. Oh, never mind. Maybe I will almost one-shot it. Yeah! That's you could do it! Yeah, that's the best part of having uh, good affection is... Dodge it, you dumb shit. Oh, okay. <gasps> I didn't get hurt! Yeah! I, l I love their affection! Like, okay, maybe it is weird with, like, balance or whatever, and is making it easier than it otherwise would be, but also they just care so much about me. Yeah, they added this in uh, Gen 6. It was... I don't think you need to learn Headbutt, but I'll look, I guess. <sighs> It's pretty powerful, but I don't know if I'd get rid of it over a quick attack. I mean, you know Yeah, power 70, quick attack is 40, but goes first. Priority and all. Get rid of agility. When am I ever, ever, ever going to use that? What was it? Was it, Pokemon? it was Pokemon Refresh in Gen 6. That was when... more fire moves is what I need. You're a fire type! Uh, you get the best one when, it, when cream evolves again, so you don't have to worry about that. 
Okay, well, I'm gonna get rid of agility because I will literally never use it. It's fine with me. Um, yeah, with Pokemon Refresh, they added that where you could just level up the affection, and that was, that was pretty good. Ooh, Frost Breath. I sure do. What is this? Ice, 60-90. Oh, this... I don't like that 90, no, no. but it will always crit. Yeah, the attack always crits. Oh, uh, what's a crit? One and a half? Yeah, it's like one and a half instantly. So it's effectively power 90. Which is good. Very good. So this is 55... Ice went, Icy wind's good for doubles, so I wouldn't really worry about that. Okay, so like, get rid of Ice Fang then? I I would keep Ice Fang because your attack's like two points higher. Icy wind is good for double battles competitively, but you don't really need to worry about it here. Okay, I may go with that then, because Frost Breath is going to be a heavy hitter. I may get rid of Icy Wind for it. Cause I, like, I like the lower opposing opponent's speed stat and all, but... I don't know, man. This is an attack move only household. I mean, Icy Wind is an attack. If you effectively use status effects up yours. I mean, that's entirely all, like, double battles and everything. Is making sure you have the right move going off so everyone can benefit from it. Tailwind and all that. Well, I mean, it's still sleeping. Yeah, me and Gumi in that very first... The very first... Pokemon of the first guy. Not me. If I lose, I wipe out and lose half my money. Yeah, if I lose, I restart to the res restart to the title screen and load my last save. I never lose canonically. Never. <gasps> Could this be character development? Ah. So one thing that I do I do really like about this game is the character development that your rivals go through. Oh yeah. It's not it's not just like, yep, there's Hop being Hop, there's that jerk being that jerk. Like, no, there there's stuff going on with them. And it's neat. And so you see Hop, he didn't even join in with you. Yeah, that was perfect double battle material and yet you just fought them both. And Hop easily before Bede beat the crap out of him or Bede, Bede beat the crap out of him like he absolutely would have hopped in he would have been so excited to beat the crap out of somebody new eh, he would have hopped in uh, but like now he's well at least it's still uh, 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 uh. All right, well, I'm just gonna... Well, time to go off to kill bird Pokemon. <laughs> well, how do you think they eat? Uh. Oh, jeez. Hey, wait, I know you. I sense something. Something powerful from her. And full of hmm. pink. Ma'am, did... Oh, well, okay, Cherry, I was gonna offer to help her, but whatever. I mean, okay. Uh, where do I look at lead cards? <laughs> Maybe the option titled the lead cards. Album. Opal. Uh, R to flip. I found it. The oldest gym leader in the Galar region. Yeah, she's 88 years old. She took over for her mother 70 years ago, and holy crap. She's been gym leader for 70 years. Yeah, it's kind of throwing off a lot for people because 
Professor Jim's even been around for 70 oh, years? Oh yeah, see, that's the thing, is because apparently Professor Oak was the one who started the gym challenges. And... That dude's probably not even close to... That dude's gotta be, like, in his 70... It, like, if he... If I was to say him as old as, he would be, like, in his 70s. But he's definitely, like, in his 60s or something, and it's, like... Kind of weird, but you also have to keep in mind, like... From what I understand, Gen 1 through 3, they weren't even trying to tie into history with the other other games. Gen 4, they started trying to do that. I feel like I could write that off as, like, maybe Oak started it maybe he started in that the, region. Yeah, maybe he started the Cantonian version. Hi. You know what I should do? Yeah, check your Pokemon's health. Yes. Maybe buy more than ten of each potion. I'll be fine. Yeah, you said that during the gym battle, and look what almost happened to you. Well, look, that was a gym battle. This is some schmuck on the street. Go, Gigantamax Centiscorch. <sighs> Can I run? Go, half my team, that's weak to this. Can I just, like, give you my lunch money now? I gotta tell you, switch out Gumi immediately, because that's a fairy type. Yeah. As if you couldn't tell by Clefairy. Yeah. Okay, so I know there's Fairy involved. Is it just Fairy? Yeah, it's just Fairy. Jigglypuff. Oh, uh, let's see here. Jigglypuff. Fire takes... Re oh, no, I was just going to say Jigglypuff's the normal Fairy type. So I don't have anything that's good against it, but Cream at least takes half damage from Fire type modes. So... Or Fairy, fairy type. type I do not know why Fairies are somehow not as effective against fire types. Maybe it's because they burn like everything else. Burn that forest. It used explosion. Close combat? Oh, fuck. Ow. Yeah, that's what, that's like the most... I like the steam that came off of me. That's the most powerful fighting type move. Well, crap. Uh, well, it's time to burn it. It also keep in mind it lowered its defense and special defense when it used close combat. Because the whole point is like you have to imagine the Pokemon like literally getting up close to each other. It's like, eh. Rain dance right. just makes it rainy. Oh, well, I don't give a crap about that. Unless there's something else I can get rid of that I don't need. Nah. Absorb? No, absorb. Eh. Did I don't like anything, but it's better than... I mean, honestly, I, I've gotten rid of Tackle, because you don't really need that at this point. But... That's that's true. Oh, no. Clefable? It's just the evolved form of Clefairy, so... More Fairy! Well, if I've learned anything about Fairy types... <laughs> it's that you'll burn them! Oh, no. Burning didn't work. Quick, burn it some more. Clearly, we're not using enough burning. Ah, uh, acrobatics. It's a flying type move. Ow, 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 ow. It does more damage if the Pokemon doesn't have... It's either if they don't have an item equipped, or they've just used an item. So it unburdens them. Even though there is an ability called Unburden, but we're not talking about that. 31. Dang, that was a jump. <laughs> Just dazzling gleam, what the Ooh, heck? Fairy type move. It's a special attack fairy type move. I mean, okay. I'll take that. Yeah, uh, I would 80! 80! Yeah, yes, I would definitely 80. I would definitely get rid of disarming voice because this is just an upgrade. I mean it is. I like having at least two of well, I don't know, it's not even a fairy type. Well, it's either yeah, a robot yet. Well, it's either aromatherapy or life do, and life do is like it heals your HP, or aromatherapy just heals the status effects of your team member. So I don't feel like I need both, and I'll probably end up getting rid of both of them at some time or another because again, Obviously. attack only, attack only household. So I'll probably get rid of aromatherapy first. I, like I feel like I can appreciate HP more than status effects. 
I wonder how this hat turn he does in doubles battles. Because with that kind of setup, it has to be pretty good. Slow as hell. Though. Yeah, with, like, a lot of healing. It is very slow, though, so that's kind of set back to it. So put it in a trick. So here's a, trick. Here's a question for you. Um, I was going to say put in the... Okay, wait, no, go ahead. I was going to say put it in the trick room team, and you're pretty good with that. Because the slower the Pokemon is, the faster it moves in the trick room. Go ahead. Wow, that's like nothing. Um, so I was going to ask... A, when you're camping, and the Pokemon get into a race, is how fast they move actually based on their speed stat? Yes. That's why a lot of Pokemon just look like they're not even going, even though they have, like, a trail of smoke behind them. It's like, man, that guy's booking so slow. <laughs> look, he's slowly getting away. It's a Yaw mask. Yeah, look at these guys. I think I already have one. No. Wait, do you? Oh, you might have. I think I do. I've gotten so much crap from those Dynamax stuns. Yes, but these are Galarian Yaw Masks. I do. There we go. Instead of being pure ghost. Look at that thing. Instead of being pure ghost type like they were in Unova, they're now ground ghost. Ooh. I wish you could see their Pokedex entry. I mean, you could all... From this screen. Yeah, you would think, but... Do I have that cactus? Ma Macaratus, I think is what it's called. I do not. Well, I'll see one in a Dynamax den eventually. I don't know. I've seen them out in the wild plenty. I don't know, I haven't seen them myself. Oh, wow, they, they actually won blood. Yeah, they're ghosts. They won for vengeance. I can go fishing. Look, you're not just going to put a fishing spot up here and not have a Magikarp in it. Can I can I throw it back? It's going to run. I think the one part that would get me funny is if you uh, fished it up. Couldn't get away. The Magikarp didn't let me escape. It contained me. I think it would be funnier if you tried to uh, fish in that thing, and, uh, you got a Gyarados. Be like, this is like, Yeah, power 20, so super effective almost doesn't mean anything. Pretty much. Ow. I didn't check what level this Magikarp was. 28. Not bad, actually. How does a Magikarp even get to level 28? I mean, I guess it's... It's learned some things over the years. It now knows, like, Tackle, eventually. Yeah, there's no... Okay, well, I want to get up there, but it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to right away. There's no real point of fishing. All you get is Magikarp, Goldines, and Dreadnaws. You saw nothing. You saw nothing. What's that, Murphy? Diglett? Diglets? Yeah, they're on this route. I'm gone. I think they're on this route. Oh, I could have just jumped down here. That didn't look like a jump down ledge. Oh yeah, those are jump down ledges. I think. Is that a dog? Or is it a dog trio? It says dog trios. It looks like it could be a dog trio. Later, nerds! Oh my goodness. Well, I'm not getting away from anything. I like how they both froze when I got... Everything freezes. Yeah, you're going up... Time freezes! Yeah, you're going up a ladder. I don't really find a problem with that. I know that was somebody's big problem, was like, oh, look at the models, they freeze when you climb a ladder. It's like, what's the problem? Okay, I'm gonna look this up, because I know... Somebody said why stow inside is called it, so... I'm gonna get my sorry butt kicked in here is what I'm gonna do. Yeah, that's a fairy and that's a dark type. So, you've literally... Cool. You've literally thrown out the worst combination. Yeah, Just, so mostly I want... Well... Cream... Togetic... And... 
Well, here's the thing. Togetic is Fairy Flying, and Ponard is Dark Steel. So... Okay, Fairy Flying. Fairy Flying, that's still Cream that I want to send out. Well, Cream's gonna... Yeah, do... I don't have anything else. Cream's so... gonna do good against Ponyard, because yeah. either or Cream's abilities. And then what's the other one? Dark... Yeah, Dark Steel. Just straight Dark? No, Dark Steel. Oh, Dark Steel. Yeah, that's uh, Cream. Also Cream! Yeah. Also Cream! Can I send out somebody who just kind of won't die? Uh, because I kind of want to swap both of them out, because they'll just both die. Yeah. Uh, probably throw well, out Mistral. Mistral will be fine. Togetic might have... Yeah, Robin flying. is bad... Robin is bad, fairy... What was the other one? Fairy flying? Yes, Togetic's fairy flying. Robin is at least okay. Neither of these are good to have out, though, is the frustrating thing. So, let's go ahead and A, send out you. And B, we'll send out... Send out Remedy, I guess. Eh. Like Remedy was it I'm like my second for dark types. You did great out there doing nothing. I feel so bad because I haven't used Hatena like at all. I just haven't gotten the chance to show it off. I feel like nothing has been good. Nothing has been weak against Psychic thus far. Okay, so you. Um, is either of them weak to fighting? Yeah, Ponyard's weak to fighting. It's also weak okay. to fire, so it would be best to use. Oh, I, well, we could just use fire then. Well, no, Ponyard would be quad weak to fighting. So it's like either, I like those numbers. Either or would be best for it. Okay, and then you, I'm going to. You can hit fairies with bug, right? I think I do not know if they are resistant. I know flying types are resistant to bugs, so. Uh, fire ground. Oh, heavy resist to bug. No. How about flying? Uh, can I hit him with flying? Just use the air slash or slash. Nope, can't hit him with flying either. Everything. Everything resists. This was not a good decision. Uh, what about the dark? Dark is... Dark flying. Dark steel. What can I hit with you? Oh, it was dark steel. God dang, I'm getting all mixed up. You know what? Just do whatever and we'll figure it out. Getting tired of looking at numbers. Just friggin' wreck them. We'll move on. Yay. Yay. Okay, well, that at least didn't normal damage. <sighs> Should be next turn. Cream's gonna fall. Okay, so I can... I don't want to hit that with bug, but I can hit it with flying, so that's cool. Otherwise, do not hit it with fighting, so... Fire it is. And again, do not hit you with bug, so air slash. I cannot keep two Pokemon straight in my head. One is easy. Yeah, why do you think they got rid of triple battles? <laughs> oh my goodness. You know what, just Earthquake! I mean, Togetic wouldn't have been affected, but... If you're that concerned, why are you putting them in danger?
Alright, let's see here. So we got... Oh no, it's seeing me. Oh no, it's coming for me. Let's fight you so I can get out of here. I was looking up something for Pokemon Sword and Shield, and instead of spelling out Shield, I somehow spelled out Shirk. Hmm. And part of me just went like, so did I, did I just tank swap? Now Gumi has all the hate. Okay. Okay, so this is, um... I think this is Bert. Yeah, it's pure fighting. Wanna... Yeah, and I want to hit you with flying. Is dragon at least acceptable? Dragon's at least acceptable. Yeah, it's dragon. I mean, that was a crit. Okay, never mind. Dragon is unacceptable. Oh my goodness, I feel so bad because I want to use Gumi! But it's so weak! Okay, hitting you with flying. Oh, I actually thought it got bigger for a second. I was getting worried. Oh, so I had another question. I have occasionally been in Dynamax Dens where the opponent gets four shield bars instead of three. What's that all about? It just depends on the Pokemon. I think the max they can have is six shields. Oh, crap. Like, but... I assumed it would maybe get bigger with, like, higher star raids. I mean, I've had plenty of five-star raids that have had three shield, three bar shields, so... Rock, just... what do I want that for? Huh? Well, I mean, it's power 80. Yeah, it's a good rock-type move. It's, like, one of the few, if not only... Rock type special attacks. Though your attack's getting a little higher for that, so I don't know how much you would care. Yeah, my that. attack is higher than special attack. And I feel like I'd be getting rid of Slash for it. I don't know if I'm. I don't know if it's worth it. Like, having that extra type coverage would be nice, but also. I don't think I'm really hurting for anything that Rock can do. I mean, Rock can take out flying types. Yeah, like, I can kind of already take out but flying types, But the problem types, with though. the flying types is that you're a bug type, so you're already weak to them. So the matchup's kind of a little wonky as is. Actually, no, I can't really take out flying types. But, eh, you know what, whatever. Eh, I'm not gonna worry about it. You can always just go to a move relearner. Yeah, you can always get it back later. That's the nice thing. We're not locked in. Oh no, you've been locked in. Dang it. It's like it ends up being one of the new... Open that menu, open that menu, no, 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 no. Open that menu. Ends up being one of the new Nuzlocke rules, is you can't go back to the move relearner. Well... Crap. Well, why? That's, like, the stupidest thing ever. Starting to think regular potions just aren't cutting it anymore. Nope. Like, I was alright having more... I was alright with only 10, because, like, I was still kind of using... Regular... Uh, kind of using regular potions. But... Regular potions just not cut... Okay, fine. Crap. Up yours! Okay, so that goes yeah, that's the way somewhere. Forward. The other way is the way forward? No, this, or this, this is the, way, is the way, forward? way forward. It's going to take you down to where you can grab that TM, and there's also a berry tree here. Something saw me. A trainer saw me. Where's the TM? You have to jump down, so if you want to challenge uh -huh. that trainer, 
first. But you actually can go through the grass as well, so... You're not stuck, but... I have not been very creative with my curry. Oh boy, another fighting type! Okay, well, we learned our mistake from last time. Time to She's kinda dumb. Smack it in the face. It used Fire Punch. What? Yeah! I love this game. I'm trying to, I think that... I think the other one is the one I'm thinking about. It's like Circle Throws, like where it just grabs you and just throws you back into the trainer. So it switches out the Pokemon. Heck yeah. Which is hilarious, by the way. Oh man, and it flinched! Yeah, that's what Aerosmith Not that that matters much, because that, it went before me. Now it's trying to use Storm Throw. Storm Throw automatically makes you go second into a, in a battle. Ah. But it's got a really good power behind it, so... Man, is it raining out there or what? First day of spring. Yeah, let's see here. Who's the lowest level? We got um, a couple 31s. Robin, Robin just at 31, yeah. so I think I need to swap Robin to be a, my lead instead of Ribbon. <sighs> Robin would have probably done pretty good against... Look, okay, it's throw. I don't know, defensive-wise, it might have been a bit suicidal. Shaking that berry tree. Shake, shake, shake it, shake. Uh, I think I take more. Yeah. I think I can shake it again. Yeah. Keep going until the leaves start flying off. Okay, there we go. It's going. I said until the leaves fly off. But I said all of the leaves. Oh. Doop. Doop to 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 doop. Okay, so that just took you down there. Okay, and. Oh, there's right. the item. Steel wing. I don't think anyone on your team can learn that. Okay, so how do I get to that shiny spot? Oh, you have to go through the... The grass there. Alright, let's just take this nice and slow, because I don't want to fight 500 of these things. If they weren't aggressive, it wouldn't be that big a deal. Can you move? I smell a soul around here. Oh, Would you like crap. to be cursed in a rock with me? No? Not really, no. Would you like to take 49 points of damage in a battle and then evolve in a weird location? Why are you like this? No, seriously, why are you like this? You didn't see me. Okay, I want to read this. <gasps> Trainer tips. Cool, thanks. Useful, useless information. There used to be HMs, but that's just the Japanese thing now. God, when did they get rid of HMs? I know they were gone Gen 7, but I don't know if they were around for Gen 6. How do I get out of here? You just go up, up and around through the grass. Man, I gotta go the whole way around. Ugh, I have to walk with my legs. Make me actually go... I was expecting to be able to, like, hop down. It's that's peasant walks. Not so, not something for a wizard to do. <laughs> okay, so what do we got over here? I've not been this way. It's a campsite, so you can fly back there at any point. Yep, campsite is nice. Another TM. Two fossilized fish. Oh, I'm sorry, I meant of. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, that was a short route. I like short routes. Nice and easy. Keep it straight in my head. 
We can stop by the campsite. We just did a lot of camping, so I'm not gonna worry about actually, well, I won't cook. But I'll like stop in and say hi to their Pokemon. Uh, Steelix. Wow, Steelix, a Hitmon chain, a Hitmon top. A um, Hitmon this person really likes fighting types. A uh, Mudbray, a Tyroger, a Macho, a Girder. Doing okay there. God, I need to get laid. Jeez. What, a Hitmon top? That's just how it travels. Yeah, this is what? One, two, three. There's multiple. four fighting types at least. I forget what um, Steelix is. Girder guy. Oh, Girder. Girder is uh, just pure fighting. Okay, so that's. Wait, how many? Okay, their whole team is here, so there are seven Pokemon. I was confused. Yeah, because but there's of that. three trainers here, so. Ah, okay. It's still like all fighting except for friggin' Steelix and the horse. How you guys doing? You... Having a good chat. <sighs> hey, Steelix, let's chat. You no, know it doesn't make sense to me. Why is the Timber family all pure fighting type? Shouldn't it be like tim How you doing? Timber is fighting grass, and then Girder is fighting steel, and then. Con Why is this thing fire? nervous about literally anything? Why does it have a great nickname? It does. You want to play? This is going to be my funeral <laughs> right here. Oh! And thus ended Tofu's. Chomp and half. They miss some. They miss sometimes too, which is kind of hilarious. Oh, you want to play too? Here. Oh, it's Titmon leaves where there as well. Everybody gets to whack. Come on, Chan is just back there confused. I mean, I want to punch it. Please don't punch it. You punch really hard. <laughs> the thing that kills me is like, how is this? How is this thing? Yeah, I want to talk. I want to talk to you. How is this? Kick uh, off. How is this toy still in one piece? It's a poke toy. It's built to withstand any assault. Okay. I'm gonna spend too long there, but you get the idea. Fun stuff, cool people. And this, this is uh, the lady. Who are you? She is the lady that creates uh, abominations amongst the Lord here. Okay, you should be fired. Yes, she is a very bad scientist, and also a reference to how awful archaeology was at the beginning. <laughs> yep. Which you can easily find a video for that, which is pretty entertaining, and. You will laugh. You will laugh a lot. We legitimately had, like... And this is kind of what it's a reference to. We legitimately had the wrong skull on the rest of the skeleton for, like, decades before we eventually went... You know, I don't think that's right. God, wasn't it like the Brontosaurus was first discovered in, like, 1911, and then it was declassified because it was the wrong skull and the wrong body part, and then we found out that there is an actual Brontosaurus, like, just five years ago? So it like got decla it was classified, declassified, and then reclassified. Okay, well maybe I'll revisit someday if I want to make something that hates living. I mean you can make Dracovich what? the Oh it's just Oh it's her. Yeah, she can she can kind of see <laughs> you from Who am I fighting up here? If you want, you can always make Dracovich the most strongest and most abomination Pokemon out there. Look, I just don't want one that's suffering, okay? They are all suffering. There is no good for these Pokemon. <laughs> There's one in particular that I know is just horrible. Like, please, why? Like, it's no, no matter how much you try, you're always condemning these new fossil Pokemon to a lifetime of misery.
Bug poison. Uh, what are you, poison? Bug poison. Bug poison? Yep, that makes... That actually makes some degree of sense. And yet, when it evolves, it loses the bug and becomes a dark poison type. So what's frustrating is Mima is, like, super resistant to everything this thing can do. But it's not weak to anything that Mima has. You know, I always thought, I, I, you know, I always keep thinking that Bug is weak to ice, and it's like... Not? Should be. Yeah, it's not for some reason, but... Well, guess what? I'm sending out Mima anyway. And we're just gonna use a not super effective mood move. We just haven't seen Mima today. Ah, uh, well, as long as I'm not doing that. Okay, so we got that 80. I do like that. I don't know. I kind of want to... Let's see Frost Breath. Alright, not bad. Oh yeah, that's right, I gave her the shell bell. Shell bell. Probably not the best use of these various items that I have, but I didn't have a lot of options, so I just said, eh, whatever. Uh, Shadow Ball. I'm gonna be honest, I never actually put a lot of items on my Pokemon, so... Yeah, I don't... I tend not to get very strategic with them. I go for, like, what raises the damage of the type of moves that they use. Uh, Pawniard. Dark Steel. Is that supposed to read as Pawniard? I think it's Pawniard. Yeah, so... Dark Steel? Yeah, it's that one we fought okay. earlier with the Togetic. Uh, uh, yeah, I will switch. I'm gonna switch to Cream. Because fire resists steel, and fire is good against steel. Not much on dark. Don't have a lot for dark. Thank goodness there's no dark gym in any generation ever. And we will never oh, have to fight about that ever. Oh, fighting is double. Let's friggin' kick you in the face! I mean, given the size of the foot graphic that's hitting them, I'm kicking them in their entire body. See, you say foot when it comes to Pontiard, and all I'm thinking of is, like, the Bisharp is just basically, like, the Shredder in this universe. So the Pontiards are literally the foot soldiers. Hmm. I mean, it makes sense. They're called Pontiard, which means they're just basically pawns. They're just pawns in the grand scheme of things. How are we looking on HP? I didn't even bother. Yeah, uh, you're fine. Okay, we're fine. Like, the most is like maybe Cream and Mima got hurt a bit, but what? Oh, that's like a sculpt sculpture. Yeah, it's an artist. It's like, what are you holding? It's a mad. It's just not a good. Oh, jeez. It's a mad artist. <laughs> My lips. I don't, I don't like. I don't like this guy. Actually, you just threw in Robin to the perfect matchup here, like, just side beam and you're done. <laughs> yeah, poison, weak to psychic. I don't have any special strengths against poison, but, you know, psychic. Eventually. I don't know, man, I remember how this fight went last time. But it went a lot better this time. Eventually, someday, I'll remind you to switch around Robin's move set, uh, move list. Someday. Pseudo Wudo. Pure rock. Wood. Rock? Rock. I was gonna, I was thinking it was like grass nope. rock or something. No. Nope. Pure nope. rock. Okay. That's pretty much... I don't have anything good against rock. Uh, yeah, mistral. Grass. No, grass, I, I was looking defensively. Oh. Uh, yeah, grass is good against it. Uh, that's about all I have, actually. I was about to say, don't have anything good against Rock. You have Step on me, Mommy Pokemon there. Yeah, she just doesn't resist Rock. 
Like, ideally, I want to send out something that's both strong to it and strong against it. Yes, but you kick it in the face once with pure grass type and it doesn't move. I mean, see. I mean, I can kick it in the face. Whatever. It's your game, loser. I mean, Seed Bomb does more damage. Lowers the target's attack. I don't know, I don't think we've seen Trop Kick. Let's kick it in the face. Oh, my face! Yep. Kicked it right in the face! But I'm just a tree. Man, I love having high affection! Besides, that's kind of the point with pseudo Wudos. You're supposed to think it's a grass type of some sort, but nope, it's just faking you out. Hmm. Like even its I mean, okay. even its Japanese name has part of the word for liar in its name, so. Hmm. Oh no, you dropped it. <laughs> it's like, all right, well, before you get creepy, I'm just gonna keep going. Diglett. Man, look at all them diglets. You can actually get up close to the ruins there and just, like, click on them. Like, it's somewhere around the fence. I think it should be. There should have been a thing of, like, you just... Look oh, at you just go up and mash. mash. I mean, that's true. But do they really know what it looks like underneath? No the world one does. needs to know. Really? A Poké Center here? Yeah, we're at Stone Side. We made it? Yeah, this is the town. Uh -huh. Alright, well, how about that? Oh no, that Bronzong's eating a child. <laughs> Alright, well, um, I was thinking, for whatever reason, there was going to be a thing between here and there. Nope, that's the town. But yeah, I guess there's not. It was just one really long route getting you here. Works for me. Okay, so I'm trying to remember what level Atena evolves. I want to say it's 32. I'm checking, I'm checking. Not fast, but I'm checking. Nothing else I'm terribly worried about. We actually have three fully evolved. Um, I know Hatena and yeah, Raboot. 32? Yep. I know Hatena and Raboot are coming up soon. And I know Gumi is 40. So, I mean, if you want to get a level real quick and devolve Robin. Yeah, let's go ahead and get a level real quick. I don't know what on. We'll find out. I mean, I could just cram some candies in her, I guess. Gotta be somebody back here I can beat up, though. That's far more Did you fight that model? This model? Yeah, okay, she's not wandering anymore. Yeah, I've beaten up all the trainers at this point. All these friggin' masks. I'm gonna beat one of you up. I mean, they're ghost types, so, you know. Uh, so, ghost, against ghosts, you use ghost and dark. Yeah. That was mostly it. We don't really have dark. And psychic is weak to ghosts, so... Yeah, Psychic does not do good. Well, I take additional damage from Ghost-type moves, but Psychic does normal damage against them. Oh, that thing's level 32, though. Fudge that noise. Why is that so high level? So what would I want to use? Ghost-type move? No, because Ghost-type also takes damage from Ghost-type moves. I mean, your best bet is honestly Mima, because she's the only one who's got anything super effective against it, but... Yeah, like, go in as Mima, use Shadow Ball, hope it doesn't hit me with a Ghost-type move back. Otherwise, well, you know, let's just toss in Mima, and if Mima bites it, then... It was all over. Just send in, Dude. I don't know, Cream or something. It was all over his fault. Wait, what? It's a new, it's a Protect-type ability. Ice, too? It's not pure Ghost. Yeah, it's Ghost Ground. Ground ghost, so. Oh, that's specifically what you mentioned before. Yes. 
I'm aware that you're not. Oh painting. well, in that case, I should have sent out. Um, oh, Mistral. Yeah. Yes, I'm. Uh, oh well. I'm aware you're not paying attention to a lot of stuff I say because it's a, it's a lot. Yeah, bite it. Another one bites the dust. Another one rides the bus. And another one going, and another one going. Another one bites Okay, so Robin is just a little over half, so... Well, we at least beat up one of those things. Let's just cram some candies into her now. Candy, 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 candy. <laughs> alright, alright, calm down. We'll get you some candy. I don't know how many. Let's just give you one and see how many it how much it gives. Plenty. I feel bad because it's so easy to over level in this game. Like if I just crammed candies into everybody, I'd they'd all be level sixty. Yeah, it is very easy to over level. Boa, boa! I hit the B button by accident. Dang it. Yeah. Hatrim. Hatrim. Using the braids on its head, it pummels foes to get them to quiet down. One blow from these braids would knock out a professional boxer. Hatrim, the vibe check Pokemon. Sir, your vibes are your vibes are atrocious. Brutal swing! That's a dark type move, but it's physical, so you're gonna wanna check what your Because Hatrim actually has the the line actually has decent attack stats. Yeah, what's, uh, well, sp nope, special attack is through the roof. Yeah, it's probably because I think you got a modest nature one, so. I still feel like having a dark type move on not Mima would be beneficial. It definitely... It's still pure psychic type. Well, maybe it doesn't have a dark type move. You got rid of that. Well, I know, that's what I kind of what I mean. Like, I don't have dark right now. I'll get rid of life, too. Can always learn it back later. You know, life will just have to do without it. Eh, eh, eh. I may want to take a closer look at Brutal Swing. It's going to do something dumb like hurt me. Uh, I think it I hits... It. God, it's, I think it hits everyone in a double battle. Hey, you can actually take this chance to switch out your on everything in its vicinity. To actually take a moment yeah, to... there. Good enough. Yeah, rearrange your... stuff and things and... Alright, there, we did it. So we're probably pretty well set for the next gym at this point. Mm. May want to grind a little bit. I don't think there's much going to happen between now and then. Yeah, you're probably going to want to grind a little. Or, you know, candy. But until next time, everyone, we take a look at Stow on side. And then, you know, maybe a gym battle.